Your boy wanna hold me South Florida Yep, he hit the real, it is the one to hit up I need a house on the beach, get some sun Palm trees, family, it's all I want Yes, 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 my friends. Hey, you already know what time it is. You know it's your favorite realtor, Pierre Nicholson. And I'm back with another beautiful property tour. Just to give you a little peek of what's going on here today, take a look. Kaboom! Beautiful property here in Miami Beach. You, your views is off the golf course. When I say completely private, when I say you're, you're close to South Beach, you're close to the highway, you're not too far from the airport, you're close to the beach itself, can I go ahead and say it? You're close to everything. Hey, listen, man, you already know what time it is. Before we get into anything else, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can be notified every time I drop a new video. And if you think about buying a beautiful home down here in anywhere in South Florida, from West Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale, or Miami, give me a call, send me a text, send me an email, even leave a comment down below and I'll be glad to help, okay, my friend? Hey, listen, I'm here with the wonderful. The only. Alfonso, we sound like, we sound, we sound like a little crew. The wonderful <laughs> only Alfonso Archer. Give it up. Okay, we here. We bought the beautiful, beautiful home. I know you, you like enough talking, Pierre. Hey, let's get back to business. Take a look. Go boom! All right. Let me give you the stats real quick before we go in. This is a five-bedroom, six-bath, four thousand six hundred and eighty square feet. Going for a delicious price of seven million nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars hey let me turn around this way because look the golf course is literally across the street when i say it is peaceful when i say it is quiet and when i say there's no mandatory fees to even join the golf course you can just look at it if you want to can you say heaven hey let's walk up to it man let's walk up to it enough said i got my great friends inside oh I, I love it when they put the full grass or even live grass in between the driveway like this, it automatically sets the tone that you're stepping into something special. Let's walk up to this. Of course, you got security cameras. I'm loving the beautiful sconces, okay? And you got a little, a nice little front yard vibe right here. Where do you see the back? The back is private. And you know, sometimes you're in a house when you're on the backyard, it's private on the bottom, you go upstairs, you can see everybody, everybody can see you. It is private down upstairs too. Okay, let's walk around the side real quick. I love how they configure the bathrooms in here. You'll see it. It's a little different. Look at this. This looks like a little oasis, man. Look at this with a bamboo, tankless water heater. You got the beautiful rocks out here, man. Like I would just put a blanket here and do yoga, not blanket, yoga mat on the side. It just have that, it just have a certain look to it. If you want to see it again, just rewind the video and look at it. Okay, let's go this way. And I love how they do the pool in the back. You'll see it. Look how they do the wood in the front. Let's walk in, man. Obscured double door entry. Let's walk in. Beautiful, man. As soon as you walk in, you see a beautiful light fixture hanging from a double high ceiling. I love how they do the porcelain tiles mixed in with the wood and they have a recess in the wall. Not the recess you go outside and play as kids, <laughs> but the recess in the wall, meaning indentation, where you can put a lovely drop zone that's not impeding on your guests' walkability into this niceness. And let's walk this way. As zero threshold, you know you watch everything. Look at that. You have Concealed hinges. Look at that. You see that lock not coming out because it's ma magnetic locks. It locks when it pushes up so that lock is not out. Okay, beautiful, man. And all the blinds in this house, 
I was told is automatic. You're like, but I see a string. I see a string piano. Look at the wires. I see a wire too. So if you want to do manual, you can do manual. If you want to be automatic, you can be automatic. I see a beautiful obscure glass. It'll make sense. After I go this way, they throw you on the vanity. You got a vessel sink. You got the fixtures coming out of the wall. You got your frameless mirror, beautiful linear vents. They floated you on the toilet. They got dual flush in the wall itself and they overlaid it with some beautiful quartz. Zero threshold in the shower. Frameless rainfall shower head. Oh my God. And look at this obscure glass that overlooks to the bedroom. When I say sexy, sexy. <laughs> That's Alfonso. So, hey, look at that. Hey, write down in the comments below if you like that feature, man. I think that's, is it Justin Timberlake bringing sexy back? Did he say anything? Bringing sexy back. Oh, <laughs> right? Here go the closet. The closets are built in. Nice. But somebody said, okay, it's built in, but it's a soft close. Don't play yourself. Soft close in your face. They give you, they're giving you everything. Even concealed hinges in the closet. Let's walk this way. I love the flow of the stairway. Here go the AC. Right here. Let's check out the garage real quick. Beautiful, man. Take your time walk through this way. Big, beautiful garage. The floors are sealed in epoxy, and I love the amount of gravel flakes they use in it. It is nice. I, what did I tell you? I love a garage with a window, and I, I like the fact that it's up high. It, it, it's, it's private, but you still let in all that beautiful light. And maybe you could reconfigure this and get a garage lift in here. Uh, you would have to reconfigure it, because the way it is now, uh, you probably couldn't do the garage lift. Let's walk this way. So. This is a bathroom, but it's also the help quarters where they could, if you have a live-in help, they could uh, stay here. Beautiful vessel sink, right? They're doing the same treatment. They float you on the toilet, do flush, and I love the wood thing that's going on in here. Alfonso taking his pics. Frameless shower in the help quarters. It does have the washer and dryer in the help quarters, but there's more than enough space to put a bed if you want, or, you know, this could just be a room, they don't have this living. You got a closet here, so you, you have options to do whatever, okay? Let's walk this way. Let's take our time. Beautiful. I'm loving the light fixtures. Double waterfall. Quartz. Double tiered with the wood. Italian cabinets. The Thermador appliances with the range hood. Thermador fridge. You push and it opens at your command. Beautiful, man. This is the freezer side, done to taste, man. Very big fridges. You got your in-wall oven, okay? Undermount sink, gooseneck faucet with the soap dispenser. You have your melee dishwasher. And I love it when they put the sink with the window like this. And you're looking at bamboo. This looks like a beautiful Zen screensaver. Italian cabinets, and I love the texture they put on the backsplash like that. Beautiful, man. Done to taste. Let's walk this way. Linear vents. And I like how they did a little drop ceiling in the kitchen and in the living room. And all this light, all this glass. If you don't know, Florida is a sunshine state. And they're taking advantage of it here. Let's walk this way. Beautiful. You got beautiful living room. I love the entertainment center, how they floated it like this. And high gloss, 
and all of this is storage. Let's go outside, man. This is why everybody moves down here. Beautiful. Wow. And close that back, you know, AC is gold. Nice back terrace. This is Eastern Exposure, so the beach is literally over there. But look how private this is. Like, this is not no fake private. This is private, private. Like, ain't nobody seen inside. Let's walk down this way. And I like how, if you see this from the side, the stairs is floated somewhere over the pool. And you have a deep side. And I'm a parent. You have a shallow side. So sometimes they give you a small shallow side as part of the pool, but I can see multiple kids, eight, nine kids, enjoying themselves in the shallow part. Ain't not worried about, oh my God, is the water too deep for them? Or you can put a nice lounge chair in here yourself. You can put even four or five in here and just chill out, okay? This is a nice big backyard. Hey, we're here in Miami Beach, okay? We're in Bayshore to be exact close to mid beach, beautiful summer kitchen right here. And I like the fact they got a terrace. Nice, look at this. Check out the house from the back. Beautiful. Okay, let's walk this way in the summer kitchen. You got wonderful countertop space right here. And I like the fact how they use the wood. Plenty of shade if you need it. Nice. All right. And I like how this is, all this is floated over the water, by the way. And it's going back and forth. Nice little feature. You see how the steps is kind of floated up. Let me walk this way so you can see it. So it's kind of almost suspended in the air somewhat. You see that, that gap there? I like that. And believe it or not, that's water underneath there. Water in between here. I like that. Nice little design feature. Okay, hey, let's go upstairs, man. Let's check, let's check upstairs out. We got, we see what we seen down here. Now, it need to be cemented by upstairs. Come through, Alfonso. Or I'll go through, you close the door. I like how they floated the stairs like that, and it's pretty solid. And the wood they use is oak, which is a popular choice. I love this window right here. And the lights on the side of the stairs. Beautiful. I see a multiple room situation. The start here. You see we're at the top. We see where the fixtures is hanging from the double high ceiling. Let's go over here. How you doing? Fabulous. Closet. Right. Take a step back to kind of see it. There's a room right here. So I guess this room can share whatever's going on here. Look at that. Floor on the vanity, vessel sink. Beautiful, frameless. Shower with that stained glass that's leading into the bedroom. And I like the fact they got this window here. You don't have to obscure it. They're not gonna see it. Even if you're seven feet tall, they'll just see in your head, <laughs> right? And they got the linear drains there which is like the norm in this type of caliber home. Beautiful. Look at Alfonso, look at the space. This is this, this how big each bedroom is. The space is very generous. And this is like a Juliet balcony right here. Look at this. Oh, that's this is, Yeah, this is like a Juliet balcony situation. Let me open it. You look, you heard Alfonso, that's a real genuine response come on man look at that 
Overlooking the golf course. Overlooking the golf course. Beautiful, man. Hey, we're here in Miami Beach. Minutes away from South Beach. We're minutes away from Lincoln Road. If you don't know what Lincoln Road is, look it up. It's a major, major place to go and shop, eat food, hang out. Okay? Like I said before, everything. Everything. And people, when I say that, people are like, oh, he does, he just saucing us up. <laughs> no, no. Prime location. Prime location. And that wind felt good, didn't it? Yeah, it really did. Outside is hot, and that wind was blowing in nicely. Trust me. You live in Florida, you appreciate that. Let's walk this way. And these doors are pocketed. Okay? Let's walk this way. Let me walk slow for the viewers so they can really take in this niceness. Wow. Look at this. And I like how the closet almost looks like a wall, right? There's no handles. You just push it and it opens up. They got something called uncut. I don't know who that is. <laughs> a portrait, beautiful. Let's try this over here. Cause sometimes the layouts be a little different. Beautiful. And I like how the light fixtures are kind of like in the ceiling, flush with the ceiling. It's not coming out, protruding in any way. When you see that glass in this house, you already know that's a shower. Zero threshold going in to the bathroom. It's, look at that. It's seamless. There's nothing there to stub your toe on. In the wall, push button. Not, yeah, dual flush toilet. And you know, when we start seeing float, we, when toys are floating, like you know you're in a, like a house house. Although you don't have to float the toilets to be in a house house, but you know what I mean, right? And they float you on a vanity right here. And just look how the light fixture falls on the sink like a godlike halo, like an angel, right? It does have a little, it have a certain look, don't it? Yeah, it really does. <laughs> Light is very important. And look how big this whole wall right here is glass. Right? I'll push this in. Zero threshold in the shower. No step up or step down. Rainfall shower head, handheld shower. And then you got this obscure glass here, which I ain't gonna lie, that's like my one of my favorite features of this house. This house is very sexy. No mandatory golf course fees? What? And we're in Miami Beach? What? And hey, let's go over here. So there's, there's, there's a space right here. And you can put the glass shelves or put extra shelves there. And this is the closet. And even this has a door right here with some more closet space. And here go the bathroom which is pocketed on the door. Beautiful. Vessel sink, frameless with the same light fixture to give you the vibes. A nice niche over the toilet. Flow to you. Dual flush toilet. Come on, man, zero threshold. They're giving you that porcelain vibes. Beautiful, man, that's all I gotta say. Beautiful. Like everybody got a nice bathroom. They didn't hold back not even a little bit. All right, let's go this way. Come on, man. Every door has concealed hinges. Wow, I'm loving it. the light over the bedroom. Like that, nice. And this one has its own balcony overlooking the backyard. Beautiful. And this is what I was saying. Sometimes you have privacy on the bottom level when you go upstairs everybody can see you you can see them was i lying this is heaven on earth right here and it's private it's all yours beautiful man and that, that's the glass of shower over there let's take our time to walk i want everybody to see everything beautiful man done to taste so this next bedroom i see that it has double door entry so you know what time it is this is the master bedroom or somebody i like to say the primary bedroom 
So let's enter the master bedroom. Let's go. Ooh, let's walk in slow. Beautiful, man. And look at this closet pocket door. Look at this closet. Ooh. They floated you. Wow. On some of the shelf space. And zero threshold into the bathroom. This is a frame of shower. Come on, man, you got a nice water closet in here. They give you the same treatment. Back out a little bit. Beautiful, man. Move out this way. You have your floating vanity, vessel sinks, and look at this. Come on, man. Look at the fixture. Beautiful, and look at this. Wow. You got your framed mirror right here over your windows. And you got your tub, and this is a nice little feature I like. You could be in your tub and still talk to your loved one in the bed. Ain't that like the vibes? So you go over here, your loved one is soaking in the tub, you're over here on the bed watching TV, and you can ask them about the day as they relax, right? And you have your beautiful Balcony. Now, right, let me see if I can open this real quick and go back there. Oh, I think I locked it. There we go. Wow. Look at the view from up here. Done to taste. Wow. Big balcony. You could talk to the other person on their balcony over there. Imagine having a conversation here, and you're talking to somebody over there, you're just having a real conversation. Balcony to balcony on your own property. Beautiful, man. Okay. Let me close back this. All right. But wait. There's more. There's more. We have an upstairs terrace. Hey, let's go to the upstairs terrace, man. We can see even more spectacular views. Let's do this. Wow. I like this window here. The neighbor is doing some renovations to the roof. Beautiful, man. But you can see another view of the golf course. I like how they got the Sconces and light these steps. You can be coming up coming up here at nighttime. Imagine you put some chairs out here with some giant umbrellas. And look at this view. Look at the golf course. Beautiful man. We're here in Miami Beach. Literally Miami Beach Senior High is down the street. Nice. So this is it. That's it, my friends. Hey. If you have rocked with me all the way to now, then you already know, man. Hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can be notified every time I, that's where I drop a new video. And if you think about buying a beautiful home down here, Anywhere in South Florida, from Palm Beach to Fort Lauderdale or Miami, give me a call, send me a text, send me an email. Even leave a comment down below and I'd be glad to help. Hey, big up Alfonso. Write down in the comments if you want to see Alfonso back, man. <laughs> <laughs> he coming back regardless, but write down coming in the comments. Back. Coming back. Yeah, man. Let, hey, hey, write vibes. Write vibes in the comments if you like the vibes, okay? Listen, man, you know it's your favorite realtor, Pierre Nicholson, down here in South Florida, okay? Thank you for watching me. Until the next property. Peace! That's all I really want, all I really need South Florida living on my TV New videos
goes out weekly Kaboom, I think I found the one I want, baby yeah. A new start, a new life, a new home Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and West Palm If I wanna hold myself, Florida Yeah, be here, the real it is the one I hit